Hello, it is Wednesday, March 25th, uh, the noon hour. I'm County Commissioner Claire Hall, and I want to offer another of our periodic COVID-19 updates. First off, I want to start off with a great big thank you to every member of our Lincoln County communities who have stepped up, who are practicing good hygiene, practicing social distancing, taking this situation seriously. We are making it through this, and we will make it through this. You're the reason why Lincoln County has strong, stubborn, independent people, but we also care enough about our neighbors and our communities that uh, we're checking on our homebound neighbors, just doing wellness and mental health check-ins with anyone who uh, we might have concern about. So please keep that up. I also want to give a big th uh, shout out to the team right here at Lincoln County. It's put unusual demands on everybody, but especially our public health, emergency management, law enforcement, and communication folks are doing things, you know, that frankly we never thought we would be doing. I have also been impressed with all the people participating in our Joint Information Center, not only our key county partners, but other folks in medicine, DHS, the school district, and others are taking part in these daily communication systems. And, you know, we're getting as used to as we can to this new normal. Now, you probably have heard that it was yesterday that we had the first confirmed case of COVID-19 in a Lincoln County resident. This sad news brings the reality home to us in a brand new way. And as we see testing uh, steadily ramp up, it is very likely we're going to see other cases. So let me uh, tell you a few things, what I can share with you and what we can't share with you about this case. Well, we can't tell you where this person is hospitalized other than to say that it is outside of Lincoln County. Our public health team is still doing investigation of this case and we'll be getting in touch individually with people that the person might have had contact with. Those who were in contact with them will be asked to uh, self-quarantine for 14 days. Uh, we also cannot tell you this person's city of residence. And yeah, I'm finding out some people are confused because uh, it's listed as a Lincoln County case, even though the person is not here. The federal disease tracking policies and mechanisms call for cases to be reported by the person's <clears throat> permanent county of residence, even if the illness develops while they're outside of the, uh, of the community. This new reality, it is really difficult. It's challenging for every single one of us. We need to be vigilant about our own health and the health of those around us in a new, different, more intense way. Many of us are facing economic challenges, in some cases very severe economic challenges. Just about every one of us is dealing with unusual isolation and emotional stress. This is a difficult time, no doubt about that. But I have faith in the employees of Lincoln County. I have faith with all of you who call Lincoln County home. We will persevere. We are persevering. And we're going to see you on the other side. Thank you.